So today we're getting ready to give this old wheel horse a makeover. You can see all the paint starting to rust. Take off all these stickers. Spruce it up a little bit. Got a little oil leak in the back. Maybe fix that. Yeah, so let's get started. All right, so I got the, the rear end all cleaned up a little bit. It was a lot better than before. We had all this grease and everything sitting in here, all this build up. I checked the hydraulic fluid. It was red, so I decided I was just going to keep it. That's fine. So I think the next step, I think I'm going to pull off all these stickers that this guy put on. So I can repaint it. It'll look a lot better than what it does now. And then I'll start on these wheels. Get these all cleaned up. Maybe put a little quick layer of paint on them. So they come around a little bit better. Now that we got all the stickers and everything off of here, we can sand it down. See, look, there we go. Comes right off. Just gotta scuff everything up, clean up all this stuff, and then we're gonna shoot some paint on here. Basically, I got everything prepped. Just gotta put a bag over this so we don't get no overspray on it. Then we can start shooting some paint. I just bought Ace Hardware Rust Stop Regal Red Gloss. Eh, it's close enough. Not really, but it'll look fine. So let's get to it. So we got the first coat on. We're not going for perfect. We're just going to spruce it up a little bit. A couple more coats and it'll cover pretty much all this. I don't know about like this and stuff over here, but it'll look better than it was.
So this is the second coat now. I'm guessing it's gonna need one more coat. It's coming out good. This is the finished product. Obviously it's not perfect. We weren't going for perfection. But I think it came out pretty good. Now it's time just to give the tires a quick coat. You see there's a lot of rust on them and everything, so let's clean them up a little bit. Alright, so we got this all painted. And outside, we got the wheels all painted. Now I guess it's time for assembly. And this is what the final project looks like. I'd say it came out pretty good.